Hey guys, big Eternal Flames Gaming, and here with me today is Shadow. Hey guys. Uh, we're back with another Mortal Kombat 11 video for you guys, and this time we're looking at uh, two, ele two elements of the game, both of which are very important in getting this quest done in Mortal Kombat 11. So the first element is the crypt. And so we're in the crypt right now. I'm gonna show you where we are in the crypt. There's our little flashing icon on the left hand side. So this is the warrior shrine, okay? This is where you need to come. Looks like this. All right, this is where you need to come to get this, um, get this task unlocked in the game. All right, so what we're, we're looking at here now is there's all these spikes set on these pedestals with chests at the bottom and behind each spike there is the, um, the image of one of the champions mounted on the wall. Okay, so what you have to do is you have to get the champions, the relevant champions head and mount it on the spike in order to unlock the chest and other elements of the game, which I'll go into a little bit later, um, and you get those rewards, right? So to do this, you have to uh, first of all know where the warrior shrine is and where these spikes are in the crypt, but you have to defeat the champion, sorry, well, in essence, yes, you do have to defeat the champion. You have to um, perform 25 fatalities on any of the given champions. And then you, uh, as, as, a, as a prize for having done that, you will receive that champion's head. Then you come back to the crypt, to the respective champion's image on the wall behind the pedestal, and you put the head on that spike, and it will unlock the chest at the base of the pedestal and it will also um, unlock another area of the game um, in the crypt um, which will give you heaps of really cool stuff to be honest um, so this is the first video in a series of videos that we're going to do for you guys all on this same subject matter okay um, so this is getting the heads for the crypt spikes okay so we're in the warriors shrine in the courtyard in the crypt all right um, now the other thing that you get when you place the heads on the spikes here other than unlocking the chest at the base of the pedestal um, is you start unlocking, unlocking various doors at the palace entrance where Shang Tsung's throne room is, and these chests usually con contains uh, usually contain new victory taunts for certain characters, which is pretty cool. Okay, so this is part one in the series. We've explained to you guys where the warrior shrine is that you need to come to. You know what you've got to look for. You've got to look for the spikes mounted on the pedestals. You know what you've got to do. You've got to put the head of that respective champion on the spike to unlock the chest and unlock el other elements in the crypt. Um, the next video will focus on how you go about getting that champion's head in as efficient manner as possible. So great to be with you guys. We will see you for the next video. See you guys in the next one. Okay guys, um, and Shadow will be doing most of the chit chat in the next video for you guys. We're just gonna swap it up, okay? I don't know at this point how many videos we're gonna have to do to get this whole process done from A to Z, but we'll be giving you guys every possible piece of information that we can to help you guys do it as quickly as possible. We'll see you next time guys, bye.